हेलो फ्रेंड गुड मॉर्निंग एंड वेलकम बैक टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल दिस इज योर होस्ट खान बाबा गॉड विल गिव यू मोर हैप्पीनेस एंड लॉन्ग लाइफ आई ट्राई टू माय लेवल बेस्ट टू गिव यू लेटेस्ट अपडेट अबाउट इराकी देना सो प्लीज लाइक एंड शेयर माय वीडियो विद योर फ्रेंड एंड फैमिली विच विल हेल्प मी फॉर स्पोर्टिंग and now let's start the today information i was excited when sadani suggested 1.32 but now i am crazy excited to see alak the governor of the central bank of iraq suggesting the same thing the parliamentary finance committee discussed on thursday with the central bank of iraq the monetary policy and banking system in the country and ways to increase the value of the iraqi dinar I quote from the article to discuss monetary policy the banking system in the country and ways to increase the value of the Iraqi dinar Folks I don't know about you but this article was wow Al Sadani talked about having 1 dollar equaling 1.32 dinars I believe in my view is when they drop the 3 zeros from the exchange rate what you'll have is about 76 united states cents then they apply the real effect exchange rate to that and that's going to be based off of their assets the prime minister is going to washington dc he's going to talk to the us treasury about the new exchange rate he's talking to it with everybody wto means currency restriction free therefore all members can use multiple foreign currencies to buy sell and trade but Iraq has decided all contracts that have been recently signed with Sadani must be converted into Iraqi dinars Al Sadani intends to visit Washington to lift the ban on banks prohibited from dealing in dollars quote the head of the Iraqi Securities Commission Faisal Al Hamas announced that three Iraqi banks were sanctioned by the US Treasury and 25 banks were banned from dealing in dollars on the issue of old notes circulated versus new notes uncirculated i can tell you this the oil for dinar program is very real and those are called private placements they require only uncirculated notes to participate otherwise if you aren't in such a private placement exchange then it doesn't matter at all also new uncirculated notes of certain serial numbers are going to be used as bonds the new dinar have all the info needed to be used as bonds and it was planned this way before the new notes were printed they will be used on the unregulated trading platforms in shanghai as part of certain trading packages Everyone is excited that Iraq has completed all the requirements to join the World Trade Organization but the bigger question is what's next for Iraq there's this impression going on around the Iraqi dinar community that this is going to happen next week or next month is this true or could the process take longer what's remaining for i hope good time starting dinar everyone working on it to increase the dinar rate stay healthy and god bless you